Okay, hello, welcome back to the Northampton Town Career Mode. Cheeky reminder to please like and subscribe if you're new. Now, Harry Smith has been doing a little sit down interview here with somebody, and this is what he's had to say. Time on the sidelines is not amusing Harry Smith as the out of favour Northampton Town man is clearly fed up with life on the sidelines. I just want to play football and I'm not getting much of a chance, he said during an interview. I can't say too much really but I love the club and the fans and it breaks my heart that I'm not being selected for the team. I've spoken to the boss about it so it's mostly up to him now. I know I can do a job. So, he gets the partner list thanks to his little interview. Hazard in goal, Angulo, Turnbull, Wharton, Hall, Johnson, Hoskins, McWilliams, Lyons and Khan will surround them. His lines. Smith. List. Returns to Smith. Harry Smith. Come on then. Oh, Harry. Let yourself down. Jones. Hope. Tries to find Charters. It's headed clear. A two who? Charters. Into McCurdy. Carlisle lead. Now, I did forget to show the table before this game. Carlisle are rock bottom of League 2. 24th. Lines. Sean McWilliams. Into the area. Tame. Tame strike at Colin. Harry Smith now. Comes inside for Khan. He's got one back. It's level. Harry Smith there, showing why he wanted to play. Brilliant drag back for the assist. Here's Hope on the left wing against Reese Hall Johnson. It's a poor ball. Cleared well to keep in. Oh, it's given away by Hoskins. McCurdy, goal scorer into Thomas. Back to McCurdy. Thomas! Oh, which is wide. Thomas. In comes the corner. Oh. How do you let that go in? Just how? Not good enough defending at the front post. Two men there. And the head is still won by the opposition. Back in front now. Hallam Hope. Into Jones. Back to Hope. Sean McWilliams is a bit knackered chasing Hope down here. Hallam Hope into the area. Chips one up. And charters with the header. Beats Hazard. Beats the defence. Directing the cameraman. It's Jones, not Charters, who scored. Popped up there by Hope. And the header. One thing that's really annoying me about FIFA 20 is that I can never quite see who the player that scored was because the nameplate at the bottom changes very, very late or sometimes doesn't change at all. These are the three subs we're making as well, by the way. Going to 4 2 3 1. Williams for Smith, Lyons off for Warburton and Karja on for Khan. We'll switch it to like this. Jones. Hope. Skoogle. Hope. Stefan Skoogle with the assist. Of course, if you watch my FIFA 19 Northampton Town career mode, he was a part of our squad and I believe League 1 in the championship. He's got an assist against us now. Here is Skoogle again, looking to pull some more strings. No, not Skoogle. Of course, Skoogle. Stefan Skoogle, the Scottish midfielder. Rub salt into the wounds as he strikes against his former manager. And there is the full time whistle for that one. Rock bottom Carlisle smashes 5 1. Embarrassing, embarrassing display. The player ranks here, there was an 8.2 for Khan. And that's it, nobody else deserves anything. Hazard with a terrible rating as well. Very, very poor. Do you think certain changes or a different approach altogether could have helped you avoid this defeat? Well, in hindsight, obviously, something went very, very wrong. 
uh, mine. Yeah. Yes, of course. There were many things that we could have changed, but I think the tactical approach was not the right one, so I'll have to take the blame for this one. It looked like you could get back into the game at some point, but Carlisle United you know, removed any doubt with their last goal. What is your view on this? Hmm. Yeah. The scoreline says it all. Carlisle with a better team. We have to prepare better for our next game. Not good enough. Elliot was one of the best players of the opposition today. Is his confident display in defence the reason behind your failure to gain a positive result against Carlisle? No. It was terrible. We were terrible. I prefer to concentrate on what we can do better. There are areas of our game that need work. No question about it. Yeah, it was our defending. Press comments then for the Cambridge game. Cambridge United at the bottom of the league leading up to your match. Are you confident you'll be able to keep complacency out of your squad? Well, after the last game, not really. The team we are facing today is far better than its position in the league suggests. We are going into the match with a game plan to win in our heads. How have you prepared for the next match against your rival Cambridge United? Hmm. We are ready. We have done everything we could to ensure we're in peak form for this match. Your recent form suggests automatic promotion is up for grabs at the end of the season. Do you have enough depth in your squad to maintain your momentum? It's because of the amazing group of players who are in this position. They all understand what is needed from them and hopefully even those not playing every week can come into the team and make an impact. To play Cambridge and it's Hazelin Gull, Angulo, Turnbull, Gooden, Hall Johnson, Lines McCormack, Adams, Karja, Warburton and Andy Williams. Let's do this. Warburton. Chris Lines. Charging forward now. And into the area. Chris Lines. Good save. Okay, subs then. McCormack for Watson. McWilliams for Lions. And Warburton will come off for Carr. Here is Carr. Andy Williams skips past his man. Andy Williams! Good save. Angulo finds Nicky Adams. Comes back. Puts one in for Carr. Good save. And Williams blocked and can't get to it. Wins the header though. Here's Carr. Carr. Back to Khan here. Williams through to Karja, skips past his man. Here's Karja, save! It squeezes in. Ugly Karja with the breakthrough. And that was a goal we desperately needed. Lovely flick round the corner, good couple of touches, and then lucky to have it bounce in. But here's 1 0. Williams into Sean McWilliams. Charging into the area now. Back heel. Karja cleared away. Here is Hannett. Lamb. Deegan. Deegan in space. Oh, he's put it wide. Hazard will launch one forward here. But Andy Williams to chase. Keeper will pick it up. And it's your full time whistle. Bottom of the league, Cambridge. Suffer a 1 0 defeat at six fields. But it is one we vastly needed after that terrible display at Carlisle. Player rank sales an 8.1 for Karja and man of the match. And actually, a lot of very bang average performance, but we get the three points. That's what matters. And Gulo continuing his hot run of form. How satisfied are you with his performance today? Hmm. Must keep momentum. He deserves all praise. Don't get carried away. Let's not get carried away. As we still have a long road ahead of us. He performed well today. He takes a lot of hard work to keep up this momentum until the end of the season. You managed to win a close match with a decisive goal in the second half. What do you think made the difference in today's game? A lot of fortune. We should have scored against, but the game beyond dealt. We hesitated after our last goal, and this could prove costly when facing other opponents. Very true. How do you feel about sealing Cambridge United's fate? They will most likely relegate due to this result against your team today. They will not. And you cannot spell likely. They will definitely not. 
We're in this competition to win it, just as everybody else. All the teams give it their all and play the best football, so make it some don't. Also, you can't even get relegated from League 2 in FIFA. See, there's a short injury for Matty Warburton, so he will miss this next game against Oldham. Harry Smith here. Has, uh, Lush has something to say. I know you'll be eventually looking for a replacement goalkeeper, but I think I can fill the role if you give me a chance. You get your chance, but don't expect to become a starting player overnight. You're going to have to work hard. Then Cameron McWilliams basically has the same thing to say, and I think we'll give the same response to him. Two good young prospects. We'll see where they can go. To play older than it's Hazard and Gulo Turnbull, Gooden, Hall, Johnson. Hoskins Adams wide, McCormack and Watson and Carney midfield and Andy Williams who inexplicably has dropped to a 63 up front. Hoskins. Lovely bit of skill. Into the area. Oh, off the post. Nicky Adams collects. And Gulo will chip it in. It's away. Watson. Oh dear. Not good enough for that, Watson. Smith Brown is tackled. Watson with a brilliant ball. Here's Khan. One on one with the keeper. Khan. Good finish. We need 1 0 in Oldham. Nice finish from Khan. Great through ball. <laughs> what is that celebration? A little bit more bad kick for whatever reason. Ball slipped through. Lovely finish. 1 0. Okay, McCormack will make way for lines. Pollock for Watson and Khan will come off for Kaja to play behind Williams, I think. Yeah, Adams may be behind there. No, we'll, actually we'll bring on McCormack so we can get McWilliams on. Hoskins, it's Khan. McCormack. Alan McCormack into the area. Comes back inside. McCormack is a good stop and McCormack and Williams. Oh, he gets the little nod on. Andy Williams. Again, inexplicably dropped to a 63. The dynamic potential is supposed to be working in this game. I know it goes season to season. Horrible replay there. That's not even a replay. It's just the, the goal line technology. But Andy Williams there. Get, I know it take, goes season to season, but he shouldn't be dropping when he's playing so, so well. They said it's something that's fixed, but once again, it's an issue that's not been fixed in these games as we create our own little replay for this McCormack with a strike comes back out to him he nods it on and then a little tiny touch from Andy scores the goal McCormack Scott Pollock finds Sam Hoskins on the right wing puts one in for Andy Williams yes no doubt about that touch on that one big Andy Williams has a brace fantastic header from him Sam Hoskins puts one across. Bang. Brilliant header off the far post. Here is Saito. Nepomuchino. Bombing down the wing. He's too fast for Pollock. Early cross. Here's Masolo into Coke. Coke now blocked. He'll go out here for Tramoni. Back to Coke. Coke held by Hazard. Oh no, it's given away by Hazard. Poor throw. It's a good piece of skill there. Still got the ball. Saito. Coke. Misolo. Oh. Come on. Charlie Good. Mistake machine. I was really hoping he was going to be much more dominant than he is. Poor performances very often. Lots of mistakes. May have to get him out of this team permanently. Clean sheet lost. Full time whistle. We do win 3-1 in Oldham. But a little bit of a sour taste in the mouth at the end. As we lose the clean sheet. It's about the match. Forgot to do the player ratings. Sorry about that. With two goals to secure a win, Williams was the hero today. Any thoughts? He always is. He just always is at the moment. Um, I'm very impressed with the way Williams played today it was a world class performance I feel like we say that every other week about Andy coming into this one there wasn't much between your side and Oldham did you have any doubt you'd come away with a win? of course not of course not 
I always expect to win, the only real question is by how much? That's what you want. Congrats on a well-deserved victory. How important was your first goal in securing the win? Good goal from Khan, it was the very first one. Absolutely, the goal provided us with a lot of confidence and was crucial to securing the win. Thanks for the questions. Okay, Sean has got something to say. I've been in pretty good form lately and I'm feeling good, so I hope you're going to bench me for the game against Crawley. Haven't figured out the squad yet, but we'll consider your request before announcing the team. So it's Hasling Gull and Gulo Hughes Good McWilliams, Carger Sean McWilliams, Pollock, Carl Warburton, and List. This is, of course, a cup game, so I'll be playing a heavily rotated side. Here is Scott Pollock as we take a free kick very early on in this match. Here's Elliot List, charged into the area. Elliot List comes back inside. Elliot List finds Warburton. Missed the last game with a small injury. But Matty Warburton is back in the team. Back with a goal. The FA Cup is up and running for us here. Good pick out from List and an easy finish. Scott Pollock finds Angulo. Khan. Matty Warburton here into Elliot List. Bit of skill goes past his man. Here's Elliot List. Elliot List makes it too. Very, very good from him. Good way to start the game with a goal and an assist. Beats his man. All ends up in a great finish. Sean McWilliams. Finds a list. Good pace. Good on the ball. Khan into Sean McWilliams it's three Sean McWilliams loves a goal started to get them a little bit more regularly our primary talent in this career mode scores to make it 3-0 in the FA Cup surely game is over already Gulo finds Khan who's on this left wing Khan now Khan could have squared it, chose to go alone, and Otis Khan with a lovely finish into the near post, 4-0. A goal all of Khan's making, great finish there as well, two defenders couldn't stop him. Corner ball for Crawley then, in it comes, and punched by Hazard. Headed back across. In it comes again. Get rid of it. Just. Here's Kaja. It's a list. Khan. Khan's lacking a lot of energy here, but he skipped past his fullback who made a terrible attempt at a challenge. Here is Khan. He checks back. Warburton! 5 0. Matty Warburton. That's the reaction you get when he's injured for one game. Doesn't like being out of the team. See then, changes are going to be Jay Williams will come on for Scott Pollock. Hoskins for Warburton and Cam will make way for Nicky Adams. Corner for Crawley then, the last seconds. Headed clear. Still got the ball though. Nope, full time. Full time whistle, incredible 5 0 win away from home in the cup. That makes up for the Carlisle defeat, definitely. See those player ratings. 9.6 man of the match for Angulo there, 9.5 for Warburton, 9.6 for Khan, 8 for Hazard, 8.5 for Hughes, 8 for Good, 8.2 for McWilliams, that's incredible, 8.9 for Sean, and 9.3 for List. That defence rating is incredible. I've never seen a goalkeeper get an eight. Well, I have, you know what I mean? It's very, very, very rare. But that perfect defence. Wow. And the clean sheet. With two goals to secure a win. Warburton was here today. Any thoughts? I have a lot of thoughts about Matty. The entire team deserves credit for this result. It's clear that Warburton stood out today. But Northampton is a club that always puts the group before the individual. Congrats on your resounding victory. Did you expect this win against Crawley? Of course I expected to win, but 5-0. We were incredibly good, and that defence was perfect. We had a solid result today, but we should not get ahead of ourselves. We have important matches coming up, and we need to keep our cool. 
quite a resounding victory today with a 5 deal score. How pleased are you with your team's performance? We can do even better. It was a great match for us. Without being too unfair to Crawley, I think we could have won by more today. Can't disagree. No. McWilliams sparkles again. McWilliams is a man who is very happy with his current run of form. I'm playing really well at the moment and really enjoying my football. He certainly seems a midfielder is in the team for the foreseeable future if he keeps his level of play up. So good from him. Hey Gaff, I really appreciate you listening to me and letting me get out there to play while I'm in form. I expect this live performance every week. If you keep it up, you'll be a certain starter. Absolutely. Okay, final game then. Doncaster in the Leasing.com trophy. So lastly, Martin Turnbull Williams, Hall Johnson, Hoskins McWilliams McCormack, Adam Smith and List. Area quarter final time. Smith, List. What will Elliot List do here? He's going to go all the way alone. Elliot List, Elliot List! Doncaster don't know what hit them. This man is electric. Great play from List. Smith will get the assist, but he played no part in this goal whatsoever. Fantastic from List. Here is Bucock. Is that Bucock? Apparently his, his name is Bucock. Couldn't tell if it was Bodcock or Bucock. Anyway, back to the game. Taylor. Taylor. Oh, dear. I deserve that for getting distracted by a man's name. Taylor smashes it in at the near post. Oh, Lashley, come on, you should do better. You just should. Here's Alan McCormack. Smith. Lovely little pass to Sean McWilliams here. Loses the ball, but he's won it back into the area. Sean McWilliams rolls the ball out, has a go, deflects into the arms of Jones. Jones will kick this ball out. A header won by Alan McCormack. Joe Martin. Sean McWilliams. Will go for the 1-2 with Harry Smith. Will instead go to Alan McCormack. He goes inside to Harry Smith. Harry Smith! Oh, it's a good stop. And cleared away for a throw-in. Martin will take the throw-in. Harry Smith. Sean McWilliams is looking to make that same run for the third time. Great touch into the area. Third time's the charm. Little drag back. Sean McWilliams! Fantastic goal. As I was saying, he picked that position up three times in about two or three minutes. And the third time produces the goal. Incredible from him. Great finish from Sean. His form is incredible right now. McCormack blasts one through for Nicky Adams. He doesn't have the pace, Nicky Adams. Blair's getting back to him. Adams! Oh, he's dragged it wide. Manager not happy. May. Over to Taylor, the goal scorer for Doncaster. Taylor was going to put one in here. Dangerous area. Jay Williams, oh no. Jay Williams with the attempted clearance. Hit it against the striker. Bounce to the other one. And they get the goal. Oh, put unlucky Jay. Watson for McCormack. List off for Williams. Yeah, Williams, I think. Oh, what else can I do here? Carger for oh, for Adams. Yeah, we'll go with that. Here's Whiteman. Crawford through to May. Oh, held by Lashley. Watson. Smith. Andy Williams. Great little ball inside. Here's Ryan Watson. Rides the challenge. Ryan Watson into the area. Plays a square ball into Harry Smith. He'll walk in. Harry Smith. Couldn't get into the team at the start of the episode. Now he's had two fairly decent performances up front. He's got a goal here. Good play from Watson. Don't want to talk about his celebration though. Watson around the corner for Sean. Oh, this is fabulous play. Now Smith, Sean McWilliams, got to finish it. Oh, that was some of the nicest football we've played in this career mode. Lovely one-touch, flicks, back heels, and so close from Sean. Corner ball then, Hoskins. 
headed away. Will be picked up by Sean McWilliams. Back to Hoskins. In it comes. Headed away. And there's the full time whistle. We are through to the next round of the leasing.com trophy. What an awful name. But we are through. Player rating sales and man of the match 9.4 for Smith and 8.4 for List and 8.1 for Rock Watson and 8.2 for McWilliams as well. But Harry Smith with the surprise best performance. Sorry, can we just grab a moment of your time? Of course, press conference time. You managed to win a close match with a decisive goal in the second half. What do you think made the difference in today's game? Um, let's see. Yeah. We should have scored again, but to put the game beyond doubt, we hesitated after our last goal, and that could prove costly when facing other opponents. You're through to the leasing.com try every next round with this win. Do you feel you can win the competition? Of course we can. It's probably the only thing we will win. If you're right, we did so far, we have every chance of winning the leasing.com trophy. Just feels sad even saying it. Taylor was one of the best players of the opposition today. How difficult was it to stop Doncaster from creating chances? Very, considering he was scored the first one and caused the second. We just played our game. We believed in our own ability and we didn't make any special plans to deal with Taylor. Thanks so much for your time. That's all the. Okay, looks like. We have a couple of conversations to have here. Elliot List has something to say. Cheers for the first team football I'm getting. I'll be doing my best, boss. Uh, proud of you. I'm proud to see you working hard. I'm looking forward to see more of your presence out there. Very badly worded. Thanks for putting me back into the team. I don't mind missing the occasional game, but I really need to play football or I just can't be at the club. Um, yeah, it could go the same. Proud to see you working hard. I look forward to seeing more from you out there. Yeah, that's fine. You did surprisingly well today, Harry Smith. Okay, and that will be it then. Thank you so, so much for watching this episode. I apologise for my voice and my throat today. I've been quite ill for a couple of weeks. But um, I needed to get this episode out. It's been too long since the last one. Thank you so, so much for watching. Please like and subscribe. And I will see you very, very soon for the next one. See you later.